Hello, how to solve for s in this equation, square root of s, square root of s, square root of s, square root of s is equal to 27. Solution. Then here we have square root of x and square root of x in and another square root of x. Then lastly, square root of x is equal to 27. Let us take the square of both sides square then we square this this square we cancel this one we have x multiplied by square root of x square root of x square root of x is equal to 27 square. Let us square both sides of this equation again. Then this will be square. Here will be s square multiplied by this cancel this s square root of s square root of S is equal to if you have a raised to power m to the power of n is equal to a raised to power m n and this is equal to a raised to power n to the power of m. This will be 27 raised to power 4. Now here, this is also to the power of 1, we have s raised to power 2 plus 1 multiplied by square root of s, then square root of x is equal to 27 to the power of 4. Le this is s raised to power 3 multiplied by square root of s square root of x is equal to 27 raised to power 4. Now let's square both sides of this equation again. This square. Here we have s raised to power 3 to the power of 2 multiplied by this cancel this we have s raised to power 1 multiplied by square root of s is equal to 27 to the power of 4 times 2 that is 8. Then here we have s raised to power 3 times 2 that is 6 multiplied by s raised to power 1 multiplied by square root of s is equal to 27 raised to power 8. Then this is the same thing as s raised to the power 6 plus 1 multiplied by the square root of s is equal to 27 raised to the power 8. And this is s raised to the power 6 plus 1, that is 7 multiplied by square root of s is equal to 27 raised to the power 8. Let us square both sides of this equation again. Square. And this square. Here will be s raised to the power 7 or square multiplied by this cancel this. s raised to the power 1 is equal to 27 raised to the power 8 times 2, that is 16. And this is the same thing as s raised to the power 7 times 2, 14. Multiply by s raised to the power 1 is equal to 27 raised to the power 
16. Then this is x to the power 14 plus 1 is equal to 27 raised to the power 16. Here we have x raised to the power 14 plus 1, 15 is equal to 27 raised to the power 16. At this point, let us multiply the exponent of both sides by 1 over 15 because we are looking for the value of s. So this is s raised to the power 15 to the power of 1 over 15 is equal to 27 raised to the power 16 to the power of 1 over 15. Then we have x is equal to 27 raised to the power 16 over 15. Then 27 is equal to 3 raised to the power 3. This can be written as S is equal to 3 raised to the power 3 to the power of 16 over 15. This 3 here, 1, 3 here, 5. And this is the same thing as S is equal to 3 raised to the power 16 over 5. The whole of this can be written as x is equal to 3 raised to the power 16 is 15 plus 1 over 5. Then if you have a raised to the power m plus n, this is equal to a raised to the power m multiplied by a raised to the power n. So this can be written as s is equal to 3 raised to the power 15 over 5 plus 1 over 5 then 5 here 1 5 here 3 s is equal to 3 raised to power 3 plus 1 over 5 let us apply this rule now this is same thing as 3 raised to power 3 multiplied by 3 raised to the power 1 over 5. Then S is equal to 3 raised to the power 3, that is 27, multiplied by 3 raised to the power 1 over 5. If you have 3 raised to the power 1 over N, this is equal to N root of A. So this can be written as S is equal to 27, then fifth root of 3. And this is the final answer. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.